Hey, it's Ryan, and I'm going to walk you through the 10 reports. At the top of the visits and conversions chart, you'll see all of your contacts. Each bar on this bar chart represents a day, and the taller the bar, the more contacts you got on that day. If you roll over the bar, you'll see each individual contact, and you can click on any contact to see their contact page with their profile and full history. Below the contacts bar chart is a visits chart, and you can roll over any day on the visits chart to see a breakdown of the referring websites and how much traffic they send. You can apply a filter to the bar chart to look at just a particular segment. Let's say you want to look at signups and see how they're doing over time. Click segments, pick your segment, and you'll see the bar charts for that segment over time. You can also filter by refer to see how many visits and how many contacts that refer is sending to you. You can filter by campaign too if you want to see how a particular ad campaign is doing. Click on the refer report to see a list of all your referring websites. For each referring website here, you'll see the visits that refer are sent, the contacts that came from that refer, and weighted conversions. Let's take a quick look at how weighted conversions work. Let's say Jenny sees one of your Facebook ads and clicks through to your site, and she doesn't convert. Then she comes back through Google next time, and she does convert. Tend will give 50% of the credit to Facebook and 50% of the credit to Google, so 0.5 conversions for each. Let's say Jim comes to your site from Facebook and doesn't convert, comes back for Twitter and doesn't convert, and finally converts on an email that you sent him. For those three referring websites, Tend will take the conversion and divide it by three, and give each 0.33 credits. Tend then takes the credits and adds them up to come up with a weighted conversion number. This gives you a more fair representation of how many conversions a referrer actually deserves, given that sometimes the same person comes from many different referrers. We then take the weighted conversions number and divide it by your total number of conversions to come up with the conversion share. This simply shows you what percentage of your conversions are truly coming from each referrer. You can filter this report by segments. So if I want to see what's driving signups, I just click signups. And here I'll see that Google is sending me a little over 50% of my signups. Click on the campaign report to see how effective each campaign is at driving contacts or particular segments. And take a look at the entry page report if you want to see which landing pages or blog posts are driving conversions. And that's the 10 reports.